Hi guys, hope you're doing well. Um, thanks for all the comments on my last video. Um, there seems to be a pattern now of people comparing me to, or saying that I look like certain people. I've had various, it started with Pete Townsend, then it was Jimmy Nail, then it was the Stone Heads in, on Easter Island. <laughs> um, and then it was Colonel Saunders. Anyway, um, I've had one today though that I feel I, I can't see it at all. It's Snoopy. Not as in Snoop Dogg the rapper, but Snoopy the cartoon dog. How can I look like Snoopy? Anyway, um, so I had a comment in my last video from a um, subscriber called Glyn. And Glyn um, said that he might try and invent or make some sort of bracket that could push the rider seat on the classic 350 back a couple of inches so it would give you more legroom now obviously you'd lose the pillion seat but the, to be honest with you the classic 350 looks so much better without the pillion seat um so glenn there's no pressure mate but if you could invent that i will be your first customer and i will promote it every single video i promise so please try and invent it and i think it i think it would sell i'm sure there's loads of people that would like to have a little bit more legroom on the classic 350 because that that bike looks so much better with just the the solo seat it really does and to have that on my bike it would be incredible so let's see fingers crossed anyway um there is a video coming out tomorrow i think maybe tomorrow or maybe later on tonight um of a comparison that i did with uh, Tallulah, my super meteor 650 and another Harley Davidson. Please no Harley Davidson haters. I know there's a lot out there for some reason. I don't get it, but you don't have to go on and say how rubbish Harley are, okay? Um, because this Harley in particular is a Harley Davidson Fat Bob. 2012, my mate has owned that from new. He's done nearly 10,000 miles on it, or 9,000 miles. He's never had a problem with it, ever. And it's what 12 years old now he has spent thousands and thousands and thousands of upgrades he's got vance and heinz exhaust which just make your ears bleed i mean it's an incredible bike and i have to say i was a little bit in love with it and uh, it shocked me actually it's that bike has got as much soul as charlie my classic 350 i honestly mean that 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 bike really shocked me and it's a different type of soul um, but it just makes you smile and you just feel you feel good um, so yeah it's going to come out in the next couple of days please no Harley haters though I, I, we got quite a few on the last uh, comparison video and I don't really get it I don't get it I, I get Yamaha Nikon haters because <laughs> it's got three wheels but Harleys have got two wheels they're a motorbike and I know not everyone loves cruisers, I understand that. And people say they're tractors and they're unreliable, whatever, okay? There's a lot of Harley owners out there that would say different. My mate being one of them. And in fact, I've got another mate who used to have a Harley and he would say exactly the same. So, you know, every bike can break down, including a Harley. So let's just leave it at that. Anyway, guys, that's going to be out tomorrow or tonight, depending. Um, and uh, yeah. And hopefully Glyn is going to be busy this weekend in the garage inventing something that can make the seat go back on the on the Classic 350. I'm so excited, Glyn. Honestly, I, you will get free advertising on my channel for the rest of my life. And I'm going to live till 121. So anyway, guys, have a great weekend. I've got to work, unfortunately. But um, I hope you get out because the sun's going to be out. It, our autumn is better than our summer was. It's crazy. Anyway, have a great weekend and right so.